What you give it on a one to ten? Uh, one. <laughs> what up, my people? This your boy M Extra. Get that, and welcome to Extra Nose Fragrances. Now today's video is a special one for y'all. They have a fragrance that just came out Monday, which is today, the day that I shot this video, and it is called Tom Ford Gray Vetiver Parfum. And yes, I have a sample of it from my local dealers. Well, whatever I got left. And the reason I don't have a lot left is because I let a bunch of people at my job smell this fragrance also. So after you hear my thoughts on this fragrance, you will also hear my coworkers' thoughts on this fragrance. Now let's get this video popping. And I also have another um, fragrance to talk about with y'all from the house of Givenchy. But we're going to do that one last. Let's jump into what I think about this Grey Vetiver Parfum. Now, the original Grey Vetiver, I didn't care for it too much. It was just, woo, this thing's strong too, by the way. I smell that thing on a thing. thing. So, look, I'm going to just tell y'all right now, this fragrance is good, okay? But I don't feel like this will appeal to the younger gentleman. It's super duper, duper fresh. And I've been wearing it. I, I've gotten it. I worn it from 11 o'clock till 6 o'clock, maybe. Yeah, about 6 o'clock. And it was still going strong. I mean, obviously not strong as the way I first sprayed it, but I, could st I was still getting wolves of it. So this thing lasts. Crazy part about it, when I smelled it on a tester strip, I loved it. When I smelled it in the store on a tester strip, I loved it. Then I sprayed it on my hand, and I was like, I don't know. I just don't know. It has a, and it's pretty linear also. The smell you get in the beginning is going to be the smell you get all the way through. That's what I get from it. But it's very fresh. Obviously, you get the vetiver. Some type of, and vetiver is grass, by the way, if you guys don't know it. So, so it does have a kind of grassy smell, but this is real smooth to me. It's not sweet at all, okay? Not sweet at all, but this is super duper fresh, super fresh. But it has a weird, a bit, of, just a little bit of a weird smell to me that I can't put my nose on. Not sure what that smell is. I'm smelling. It does smell good, but I feel like it just doesn't work on my skin. Because I love it on the card. It's great. I love it on the card. It's just, it's just, it's it's real uplifting. Not gonna lie. You spray this on this summertime in the bottle. I can see a lot of people buying this. But for my money, $290. Hmm. I I'm not I'm not ready to spend that on this yet. This, but I can see. The older gentleman loving this fragrance. I don't mean old grandfather type of men. I just mean a young, or you know what? Let me correct myself. It's nothing wrong with making mistakes. I just made one. So what I mean is a untrained nose, a person who hasn't smelled a lot of fragrances probably won't like this. But if you got some experience with some of those more out there fragrances this is and it's crazy because this is not really out there but it's just a different type of smell i literally get like a grassy smell so and maybe some type of lemons or something but honestly i don't get a lot they i think they have citruses listed in the note but i don't get a whole lot of citruses it's probably like lemon grass or something like that Yeah, but hmm, woodsy. I it's 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 good, but for that price, my humble opinion, I would not spend two hundred and ninety dollars for a great better better for parfum. Now let me show y'all what my coworkers thought about this fragrance. All right, I'm here with Billy, my boy Billy, and his kid and caboodle, and we about to let him smell the great better for parfum. Billy is well versed on cologne, by the way, man. No, Let's see too. what Billy think about it. He a harsh grader too. 
Yeah. Better for strong. Definitely. I like it. Then, All right, now I'm about to. I'm here with my boy Lucas. <laughs> Lou, man. Lou whatever you want to call. <laughs> <laughs> About to let him smell the new Tom Ford Gray Vetiver Parfum. Now, this is interesting because he a younger dude. You know, younger dudes don't usually like that Vetiver, but let's see. Let's see if he got an old soul. I don't like it. I, I knew it. It ain't for, so it ain't for you older gentlemen out there. I mean, you younger gentlemen out there, but I'm, I'm, I'm young at heart. So I like it, me. It smell like a pie, so. <laughs> right, now I'm here with my coworker Jimmy about to smell the new Tom Ford Gray Vetiver. Now Jimmy, one thing about Jimmy, he don't like that sweet <laughs> shit. So I think Jimmy might like this one. So tell him your honest opinion on it. It's one of my fishing buddies. I like that it's subtle. He like that it's subtle. You like it though? Yeah. What you get? You sit down, you damn sure gonna be shorter than me. All right, now this is my boy Duwap. You hear me? See, that's why we call him Duwap. I'm gonna let Duwap smell the new Tom Ford Gray Vetiver Parfum. Duwap probably my hardest grader. He don't like nothing. Keep it real though. What's your honest opinion? Mm -mm. He said, mm -mm. <laughs> "You don't like it? Mm -mm. Why? What it smell like? I don't know. It doesn't. Does it smell like grass?" Let me see. I don't know. It's too, I don't know. It's too light. It's too light. It's too Do light. I don't like it? What you give it on the one to ten? Uh, one. <laughs> I'm here with Raymond Therese. I'm about to let him smell Tom Ford Great Vetiver Parfum. Let's see what the older gentleman think about it. He's strong. Though. Look at his chest. I like it. Now this Raymond son, see he got the same chest like his daddy had. <laughs> <laughs> this is time for Great Vetiver Parfum. New fragrance came out to date. What you think about it? I like it. What you give it on the one to ten? It smells different on different people, but I said eight to a nine. Ooh, Ray gave it eight to nine, so you'll definitely get that. <laughs> Rachel smelled a new time for a great vet of a part four. I like that one. Okay, and you saw for yourself how that went. So the decision is up to you. You go out and smell it on your own, but for me, I will not be purchasing a full bottle of time for great vet of a part four. Now, let's move on to the one unboxing I have, and this is from the house of Givenchy, and this is Givenchy Gentlemen Only, the EDT version. Now, I know, I know, I know, this is an old fragrance. This is an old fragrance, but if you've seen my collection, you know that I love Givenchy. I love Givenchy. I have a lot of them. Not all of them. I don't have the absolute one. I don't have a few of them. And if you tell me what's your favorite Givenchy fragrance, so I could try to add that to my collection, man. I love Givenchy fragrances. They're real good quality. Some of them don't last as long. Hopefully, this one is different. Mm, look at that blue juice. Look at that. You know what? I'm tripping. Check out the bottle. Watch this magic. Check out the bottle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting a little better with my editing skills. You hear me? A little Picasso with the editing. So, I love the way this. And I hear that I've heard in comments that I've read in comments. Sorry about that. That this smells different from the other one. So, that intrigued me. So, I went out and purchased this baby. Uh, yeah, let's see what it smells like. Different color cap from all the other ones. I got a feeling it's gonna be a ooh, great spread like all Givenchy. It's gonna be fresh. Because of the blue, I'm just assuming it's gonna be fresh. Ooh. <laughs> ooh. Oh. 
Ooh, ooh, I smell that thing on the pain thing. <laughs> ooh, yo, chew. Man, look at here. <laughs> you hear me? See. Lord, see. Take these mother glasses off my face. I want you to know. I want to look at you when I'm saying this. Yeah, <laughs> you hear me? Man, it's that thing. It's that thing. This is that thing on the thing thing. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Hold on, though. Hold on. This is fucking gorgeous. Why did I wait so long to get this one? Oh, y'all ain't tell me about this one. But damn, it reminds me of something. Hold on. It reminds me of, well, I think it reminds me of this. Let me smell side by side. Maybe I'm tripping. Maybe I'm tripping, but damn. It sure brought me to this. Let's see. Maybe I'm tripping now. You hear me? I trip sometimes. You hear me? Might be a little banana on the floor. Yep, yeah, trip. Okay. No, I am sorry. I'm sorry. Nope. Pip, get out of here. I'm sorry. It, it 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 don't smell like that um Ferragamo. It does not. But it definitely brought me there. I thought, oh, this is good. It even got a little leather in it. This is oh I'm liking this one. This is a get that. Oh. This is fresh. It's sweet. It got a little leather, and this, and look, I'm not a crazy leather fan. I don't like that rough and tumble leather. This is smooth leather. This is smooth, man. Oh, yes. Summertime, here we come. I'm digging this Givenchy. Add it to my little collection. Oh, man. Like I said, any Givenchy fragrances that y'all, um, can drop in the comments drop them man i'm you know i'm always letting y'all put me on game i ain't afraid to learn so drop that in the comments let me know what fragrance y'all want to see me review next and i'm gonna get that done for y'all if i don't have the bottle i'm gonna buy it because i work for you guys oh this is good stuff right here i don't know what took me so long oh crowd pleaser right here Crowd pleaser right here. I will get back to y'all on the performance and tell them, man, it's your boy M Extra. Get, 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 get that. Yeah.